What is the crack and welcome back to another video. In this video I'll be showing you guys things at Cabiosos slash charity shop. I'm recording this right after episode 71. I think this is 72, so hopefully everything is seamless. But um what's it called? Sorry in the last video that it was so short. I bombed through all the items really fast. I don't know why I done it so fast, but yeah, I did. But this time we have like 13 things to show you, so hopefully this should be a little bit longer. But the first thing I got was uh, Initial D. This was actually really cool to get, because I just found out it was an anime, and then I found a manga that day. Well, me found it, but it was fucking really cool to come across, and we pretty much got this for free, because the uh, we were it was 3 euro for the next thing I'm going to show you, and this was 2.20, and the woman only charged us 3, so we got this for free. And, uh, I really love the song Deja Vu. It is fucking deadly. Just listen to that on YouTube. So, getting this for free, an extra manga, is a good thing to get. I know I said I wasn't going to collect them, but... You guys are going to see I got another, like, seven manga to show you guys now in two seconds. So, if you guys know if any of these are good and what one I should read first, let me know. I don't have, like, the second part of this. I don't have... The first part of some of the ones I'm going to show you, it was just what was there. Maybe the other ones will be there next time. I really don't know. Also, sorry, I'm not really looking at the camera most of the time. I kind of like keeping contact on my ca on my uh, monitor to make sure it's not fucking up. But that was the first thing. So that one was free. Everything's going to fall now because of the weight difference. So I'm going to have to... No, it won't. Sorted. The next thing we got was Edge. Um, this is number eight, I think, or six, or yeah, number six. So this one was three euro, so we got the other one for free. I don't know if this is a, uh, this is more of a comic, not really a manga, but um, I have no idea when it comes to Edge. I don't know if it's a Marvel, if it's a DC, if it's a fucking, I don't even know who makes these. They do, whoever the fuck that is, cross gen. Never heard of them. To be honest, so I can't say if it's good or not. If you guys know it is, I will look into getting the other ones. Everything's gonna fall. <laughs> okay, maybe you can laugh. <laughs> I feel bad after telling you to be quiet. <laughs> okay, so the next things I got, I got all of these for three euro, and. Uh, they were two twenty each, and as I was buying them, my little sister I had with me yesterday said, "They're fifty cent. They're on the kids show." <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Really? Gravity is a bitch. But um, fuck's sake. <laughs> but um. As I was buying them, my sister said they were on the kids shelf, so they were 50 cent each. So I saved, well, like 14, no, I saved like 12 euro on getting these. So the first one I got is Neg Negima Volume 2. I've no idea what any of these, or like any of these are. That is um, a great image to have on the back. To be honest, she looks like she's doing that little uh, the hand thing at her poo. But um, I don't know where to put them now because of gravity. I'll just put it here. The next thing I got is um, Tokyo Pop Snacks, Volume Two. Um, I've never noticed that on the back of it. It has Essence Moon Aryan. DN Angel. Uh, no idea what that one says. Girl Got Game. Immortal Rain. Paradise's Kiss. Princess Ali. Psycho Academy. S Sakui. SGT Frog. And Virgin College Media Star. <laughs> or. Tor. I can't fucking see it because the label's just over. It's just showing another anime that. Is like maybe part of series I don't fucking know but um this one reminds me instantly just because of the 
the drink and the chips it reminds me of that weird cartoon that's like for stoners I actually don't know the name of it it's just, just like a meme it's like you uh, this is the the bible and it says, it says bible you question the mighty Jimmy or something that's the only thing I know from it um, I'll show these two next because this is uh, I got volume 8 and volume 9 it is the mysterious play of uh, e, uh, I don't know if that's an I or an F. If it's an F, it's Fushige, Fushigi, you you guy or issue issue. Yeah, <laughs> it's that bitch. It's an F. Yeah, fish fishki, uh, Yugi and uh, number. Oh, they're just called the mysterious play. This one's called friend, and this one is called love. I'm not even showing it in the camera. This one is friend, and this one is lover. This is number nine, and this is number eight. Again, if you guys know if any of these are good, let me know, and I will go about uh, getting them. One of the next, not this, the next one, but the last one I'm gonna show you. I really want to read. It just looks really good. Um, Flame of Rebecca or Rekka. Something like that. It just look. It looks cool. It looks kind of like a mix of um, Hunter X Hunter and fucking. The name jumped right out of my brain, but it kind of looks Hunter X Huntery, if that's a thing. Um, I one page just caught my eye. Where the fuck did that go? I need to do it backwards to see if I can find it again. <laughs> I didn't find it, but that page was... <laughs> that chap looks like he's just got fucked in the eyes. Oh my god, you're messing with the girl I love. That's a... Yeah, okay. But again, for 50 cent each. Like, a normal book for 50 cent is good. But um, this one I really want to read because... I don't know if it is, but I hope it is. Chrono Code. I'm hoping this is something to do with the game Chrono Trigger. Um, I've heard the, there is like a manga or, or like an animated series around it. But I would like to know if this is it. Um, I haven't played enough of Chrono Trigger to actually know. Flicking through it and I often... It looks very robotic-y and... There's spaceships and shit, and I just saw a guy with a weird eye thing. So maybe there's the time travel shit in this that Chrono Trigger has. I don't know. The next thing, I'm going to show uh, the a painting we got um, now. So headphone users, please watch out. I'm afraid everything's going to fall because I'm shifting my weight, but we will see. Okay, so the next thing we got, this was a fiver. Well fucking worth it, to be honest. And it is this. Save for the glare of my uh, screen on it. I have it tilted to where it won't be visible. For But for five euro, this is cool. Keep in mind, my camera's inverted, so whatever you're seeing now, just kind of flip the image. It looks fucking sick. Like, the detail is really good. Also, there's me in the corner. I can see me but um for five euro my camera is not doing it justice to be honest like this is fucking sick little waterfall cool pink moon in the background really reminds me of something from um like no man's sky or some shit also the frame is a little bit ugh, so you can kind of hear the the glass and all moving which is uh, i'm a little bit afraid of breaking the next Five things I paid six fifty. Also, I just realized there's also another thing I got, which is a Harry Potter thing. The thing, the Harry Potter game. Uh, it's alright. I'll, I'll just show it next week. I'll, I'll just show it next week. <laughs> but um, I paid sixty six cent each. No. I got the four games for three euro. So what's that? Seventy-seven point five cent each. Um, 
First one, I got I got all of these for the sole purpose of selling them back in bar one. Um, so, Sims 2 pets, I can sell in for two, I believe, or maybe three. So, that's alright. I paid, again, 77 cents for it. Next one is Sims 3 on PC. I can sell this in for seven. And when I opened it, I was pleasantly surprised to find out that the disc is now gone. <laughs> um, I put, I remember putting it in this one. Um, when I opened up Sims 3, there was Sims 3 on the Wii. So, this, I can say, it used to be like fucking 20 euro about three months ago. I don't check Sims games. I'm not a fan of Sims. I just know that you can get a decent amount of money for them, depending on what console it is. But the disc is uh, a little bit scratched, but not too bad. But I can sell this in for five break it why don't I and underneath uh, Sims 3 on the Wii there was the original Sims 3 on the PC so I got uh, for these two I can sell them in for nearly 15 so pretty good next thing I got was Final Fantasy 12 I already have this um, disc I believe is like fucking amazing condition if I remember correct yeah, like, non-fucking-played. Like, maybe one fingerprint right there that I just put on it, but... Other than that, still has the book. Oh my god, it still has the receipt. Let's see when this person bought this, and for how much, in a moment. Uh, it still has, like, the final word thing, like a little book yoke, and, uh... Telling, <laughs> saying you can win, um... Fucking uh, Final Fantasy on the PSP. So, uh, yeah, this is fucking old... So, I haven't looked at it. I'm going to say about... Pfft, ooh, Smith. Smith's closed in Bray about three... Two? Three years ago. They stopped selling PS2 games. Uh, about the same time, actually. About 2014. Not Smith's, but like they stopped making PlayStation 2s. So, I'm going to guess it's... 2007? Maybe 2009. I want to go 2009. I don't know why. I know I'm so wrong. Price? I'm not even... I don't fucking know. 25 euro? Let's see. Holy shit. That's fucking dear. Okay, they bought this in... I should have went for 2007. Fuck. 26th of the 2nd, 2007. They paid fucking 55 euro for this shit. I got it for fucking 77 cent. And you know what's worse? My brain has a thing where the less you pay for a game, the less I play it. And... 77 cent. This was fucking 50. This was 10 euro cheaper. Well, 20 euro cheaper. Then a P PS4 game. Holy shit. I love when you find receipts also in it. Uh, it's, it's just a cool little blast from the past. Next thing I got was Prince of Persia Forgotten Sands. Honestly, thought I had this. Um, I did not know there was a second Prince of Persia game on the PS3. I thought it was only um, Prince of Persia, just the uh, weird one. But this is the collector's edition. And everything is in it. <laughs> Fair fucks. I got this for 350 if I didn't say. But um, I traded in my... Uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 3 on the PS3 and on the PS4 and I got 29 for them Could I should have got 32 but I waited too long and Black Ops 3 on the PS3 went down 3 euro but um, I used that credit to get this so I pretty much got this for free the way I see it and 25 50 extra credit on top of that but uh, this comes with uh, a bonus disc of the game uh, another the game disc and it comes with uh, some Uplay codes, which are most likely used. Uh, oh, I did not know it came with that. Prince of Persia Classic. The very fucking first Prince of Persia on, like, the NES or SNES. It comes with a download code for that. I already have that, to be honest, so that's not a big whoop for me. Um, and Eve is waving in the background as she wants it. <laughs> um, fucking Uplay shit. And the lithographs, which are actually really cool. I like that a lot. 
I don't know why, but my camera is just being really shit with detail right now. It is not the best. But, um, I will show you guys. It only comes with tree. I think tree is just like a... I think everyone goes with. It's, it's South Park done tree. I think Destiny. Destiny done postcards. If it's, if it's lithographs, it seems to be tree. If it's postcards, it seems to be like seven, six or seven. Um, but the first one is... Uh, do you feel weird? Do you feel kind of... Cardboardy chalk. It's like a weird feel. It's hard to describe. But uh that looks it again my camera's not doing justice to it. But uh it looks fucking amazing in real life. I'll show that one I'm gonna sneeze headphone warning. <coughs> there we go. It wasn't me. Um then the palace or chapel, whatever the fuck. And then this one, which I really fucking like, which is, it reminds me a lot of, um, Aladdin, when he goes into the, uh, fucking chamber, and, or whatever the fuck, the underground shit, and it's just full of gold, looks cool as shit. Also, I can't remember if I said it at the beginning of this video, because this is my second time recording it. Rest in peace to my green screen, it is fucking dead. It just does not want to stay up anymore. It is giving up on life. It is like me. It has gained weight and is just bloated and falls over. It does not want to do shit. <laughs> Speaking of not want to do shit, this fucking envelope doesn't want to close. You know what? Fuck it. <laughs> I'm not closing it. And the last thing is by far the fucking one of the best things I've ever got. I said to Neve. Neve got me a, a present last year for Christmas, and I said, this is on par with her present. And I am definitely 100% doing a playthrough on my channel of this. If I can get an emulator on my PC, if anyone knows an original Xbox emulator, that works. I've tried loads of them, and uh, I, what was it called? I, I'm thinking Espeon, but I know that's the name of my fucking printer. Um, something Espeon, S, something like that. It's a weird one. But um, if anyone knows a good working one, King knows one, but <clears throat> he was saying his friend could only get it to work, he couldn't. So hopefully if you guys can actually let me know if he is... Oh, this video is nearly fucking 18 minutes. See what happens when I just ramble? Fucking hell, I've done the last video in like six minutes. But um, this one, oh my god. Fucking Jet Set Radio. It's Jet Set Future. But it is Jet Set Radio. It's, I fucking love this game. I played it... I actually have only ever played the emulator of uh, the Dreamcast. I want to say GameCube, but I think it's Dreamcast because I say it. Um, this has... Some of the best fucking graphics ever. If people don't know what this is, you are a kid on rollerblades that goes around and has to graffiti, music, uh, like DJ fucking, what's his name? Professor, DJ Professor K. You have to put like tags all over the town and it's kind of like Tony Hawk, pro skater, mixed with an open world GTA thing it's, it's fucking weird but it it is so good i don't know again if the music is uh copyrighted or sh or not but this has everything in it the book is fucking big as shit for some reason <laughs> uh the game has nothing on it i mean the person bought this threw it in a closet and forgot about it because this shit is sparkling like, there is nothing on this bitch. Nothing. And I got this with Sims and Sims 2 and the other thing for 77 cent. I can sell this into CEX for nearly 20. I'm happy with that. I might play it and then sell it. Because if it's worth a little bit, I might as well... Um, I just cut my fucking hand off this glass. Um, I might as well 
gain a little bit of money for it. This video is coming at the 20 minute mark right now. I'm going to end this video. Sorry for it being so long. It's what happens when I ramble and when I'm excited about shit. Not saying I wasn't excited about the shit in the last video. It's just I want to rush it because we're getting nearly close to 10 o'clock. And I just kind of want to bomb out uh, sh uh, the video for you guys. Fucking hell. I fucking cut the hand off myself. Fucking sharp ass glass. It wasn't even glass. It was this fucking clip bitch right here at the back. But, um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up. Comment, rate, subscribe, share with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. It really does help me out if you guys do that. Um, there will be... Maybe I'll put a vote at the top of this video. And uh, I'll throw in two or three games for me and Neve to play tomorrow. But will be today by the time this video goes up. Um, if you want to click here, there should be a little subscribe button right there. It helps my channel if you, if you click it. There will be a playlist right here of the last 71 or 72 videos of the Carboot Cells series. If you want to go and check any of them out, it will also help the channel. And if you click right here, there should be a video just for you uh, based on YouTube's algorithm bullshit. But, um, yeah. Also, just a little side note, I finally got paid from YouTube. Praise the fucking Lord. Three months without getting nothing. And now, well, not three months. It's been a full year that I have gotten nothing. But it's been three months where I gained nothing into my money. And now I finally have gained a little bit of money. And I was just about to do a fuck you video to YouTube. So they're lucky. But uh, again, just the little subscribe button. The little um, playlist if you want to go and check it out. And the video just for you. Thank you guys. And I'll see you guys in another video real fucking soon. Bye. I forgot where my mouse was.